guys welcome back to my channel i've not done a proper sit down video in such a long time actually so this feels very strange please bear with me just for this video but i am gonna do a perfume review which i have never done before but i have been using some new perfumes recently and i thought i would review them and tell you all about them because why not everyone's always looking for new perfumes but perfumes that are actually affordable because some perfumes out there like are so ridiculously priced it is unbelievable and there are so many companies out there that do dupe perfumes that are inspired by the big brand ones and they are just as good if not better and they don't burn a hole in your pocket which is amazing so i am going to talk to you today about dialect and I have been trying three different perfumes recently and all three of them are just absolutely gorgeous. Also in my package there was a tester which I thought was amazing. Um, usually if I get testers I put them in the car. <laughs> this is way too good for the car. Um, but I will talk to you more about this one a little bit later. So which one should we start off with first? I have chosen the spicy vanilla obsession because anything vanilla i absolutely love a sweet symphony which i thought sounded really nice and uh peach brulee they are all 50 ml bottles and the packaging i just find is so simple um but so sophisticated like i feel like they look really expensive the packaging also dialect are so affordable for the 50 mil the ones i've chosen i believe are like 19.99 and at the moment they're doing a buy two and get a third free you can never have too many perfumes i think you can have like a daytime one nighttime one and you can layer these perfumes up as well and almost like create your own scent so i'm really chuffed with all the three that i've chosen to be honest so all of the ingredients are vegan and cruelty free so i think this brand as a whole is just amazing they do carbon neutral delivery the packaging is all recyclable and the price is just incredible so they think more of the fragrance instead of the brand so i think that's why they're so affordable because they are just focusing on the scent which is what it's all about isn't it it's about smelling good it's not about the brand name that you've bought it from it's actually about the scent and they focus more on that so they have created all of their scents um, in France so they've really really thought hard about all of these different scents I think they have around 26 at the moment and they are all inspired by the big brand perfumes and they have got more in the pipeline so yeah I am definitely gonna get some more because I actually really love them so a lot of this the perfumes that I've had before in the past you spray and then like a couple of hours later you're like oh I'm gonna spray again because I can't smell it anymore and I know you get used to it but these do genuinely last I'd say for around 10 hours I could still smell them come the evening time so yeah you definitely don't need to respray they are eau de parfum so they are nice and um, strong like you can see the scent oil on your skin when you spray so you know that it's a very very good concentrated perfume you also get a free 30 day returns policy which I think is great so if you're not happy with it you're not really sure on the scent you get 30 days um, yeah and you can send it back and maybe try another one so we're going to start with sweet symphony now this is um a 50 ml this is the packaging and it's got all of the the main notes on the um back of the packaging just so you know what what is in there so the main notes for sweet symphony are mandarin rose jasmine and patchouli and this is gorgeous i've actually got this one on today i think this one's my favorite here is the bottle itself. How gorgeous is this? I think it's so simple. It looks so sophisticated and it looks really expensive. Yeah, incredible. I'm so pleased with this. All the bottles look exactly the same and they just changed the name of the scent. So all the bottles are absolutely identical other than the name, obviously. Uh, the lid is lovely. It pops off. It's quite heavy. I I think the bottles are quite heavy but I think it's just like good quality and the spray is amazing now I'm going to show you I don't know if you're going to be able to see it but 
it's such a good spray oh my god it's so gorgeous so i'm going to read out the other notes for you so the base notes are white musk moss amber and patchouli the middle notes are jasmine rose hyacinth and lily of the valley and the top notes are blackcurrant, plum and mandarin. It smells so fresh and so sweet. I absolutely love it. It's fruity and explosive. You can smell the zesty blackcurrant, the mandarin and the juicy plum. It's powdery amber and soft white musks. And it works in harmony with the deeper notes of the moss and the patchouli. This is going to be my daily scent now, I think. This is absolutely gorgeous. I love it so much. And as I said before, you can still smell it into the evening. So yeah, that is Sweet Symphony. And this scent was inspired by Miss Dior. So the next one I'm going to show you is the Spicy Vanilla Obsession. I love anything with vanilla. I don't know why, I just, I feel like anything with vanilla in and it's mine. So again, packaging, same as the others, although the other one had a blue on the side. Um, and this one is like um, an olive green, it actually matches my bedroom very well. So that was the one before, um, that is the Spicy Vanilla Obsession. So this one is inspired by Black Opium and it's kind of like a dark, luminous, bewitching type of scent. The main notes are coffee, jasmine, patchouli and vanilla. So I will show you the bottle again, it's exactly the same as before. Um, the scent's obviously darker. And again, exactly the same, spray oh. is just gorgeous. I love this one. This is the one that actually reminds me of my mother-in-law, but it's gorgeous. And to be fair, she does always smell nice. So the base notes for this are tonka bean, vanilla, white musk and amber. The middle notes are jasmine, freesia, cedarwood and sandalwood. And the top notes are plum, marshmallow, coffee beans, bergamot and orange blossom. So the dark, luminous and bewitching um, scents inspired by black opium. A jammy explosion of plum combines with a fresh accord of bergamot and orange blossom surrounded by roasted coffee and marshmallow. I'm sorry, but how nice does that sound? It makes you want to eat it. <laughs> A fresh bouquet of jasmine and freesia follows a woody note of cedar and sandalwood and the deep patchouli is joined with a fresh soft white musk the tonka bean vanilla and amber combine in a hypnotic seduction and it's true like this is such a gorgeous scent even mixed with the other one like it smells incredible and i'm not hugely up on like the big branded perfumes like i'll just go into a shop spray something and if i like the smell I, I like the smell. I don't care whether it's like a huge expensive brand um, or not. So, so it's difficult for me to completely compare to obviously the big brands, but like those alone, if you don't know what the other ones smell like, just smell incredible. Okay, and this one was, I wasn't sure because like it, it sounds really fruity, doesn't it? Like peach brulee smells really, really sweet. Um, again, same bottle, but this one's got the yellow on the side, um, which I really like, actually. I think that it's nice that they've done different colour for each scent. But this one is inspired by Bitter Peach, and it's an exhilarating and terribly exciting passion scent. So the main notes are peach, rum, patchouli and vanilla again, and of course I'm a sucker for vanilla, so... I will show you the bottle again, although surprise, surprise, <laughs> it's exactly the same. I was really surprised because I thought it was going to be super, super sweet. And it is sweet, but it's a really pretty sweet, quite unique, I'd say. Um, I'm going to spread this side so you can see, although my room is just smelling gorgeous at the moment. See, I really like that. That's really growing on me. When I first sprayed it, I was I was a bit unsure. But that is really growing on me. And actually, when you smell it like that, it doesn't smell great, I'll be honest. But when you spray it out, it smells completely different. God, I love that now. I actually really love that now. For the peach brulee, 
the base notes for that are patchouli, sandalwood, vanilla and tonka bean. The middle notes are rum, cognac and jasmine. And the top notes are peach, blood orange and cardamom. So it's a captivating and thrilling fragrance that embodies the essence of passion. It brings a scent of enjoyment and energy. It begins with a burst of divine peach, complemented by bright and spicy notes of the red orange and cardamom. The heart of the fragrance is revealed through the seduction notes of the rum and the cognac, perfectly balanced by the touch of jasmine. Finally, the scent reaches its peak with the fusion of bold patchouli and sandalwood, paired with warm vanilla and tonka bean. It all just sounds so good. I mean, how they think about putting these scents together is just mad because you just wouldn't even think that they all smell good together, but they do, they smell incredible. So yeah, I have been using these recently and like I love how I smell now. <laughs> I know that sounds really, really funny, but I used to just wear the same perfume like all the time. And you know when you just can't smell yourself anymore, like I always smell my husband and he smells good like all day. He'll come home from work and he'll still smell like he did in the morning when he first applied his um, aftershave aftershave perfume scent he always smells incredible and I said to him like I swear I don't smell like that like I swear in the morning and then come the evening time I know I do a lot with the kids at home and I'm constant on the go so yeah I guess probably it does wear off but maybe I just haven't found the right scent yeah with these dialect fragrances I'm honestly so happy with these I um, have a code to share with you which I will leave in the description below. I think it's a 15% code, don't quote me on that, 10 or 15% code. So um, enjoy. <laughs> oh, I was gonna talk to you about the little tester. The little tester in my package, which I thought was really cool. I wasn't expecting that. Right, this one is gonna be my next order because when I sprayed it last night, I was like, oh, oh my God, it's so nice. First, it's called Amber Infusion. Way too good to be a car spray. You know, if you get testers, you always put it in the car and give it a bit of a spray. This is way too good for that. So, little tester called Amber Infusion, and this one um, is inspired. It's inspired by the version of Baccarat Rouge 540, and the um, the 50 ml I think is 39 pounds instead of buying Baccarat Rouge for 215 pound, which is just insane like how can you charge that much for a perfume this is like a little two mil but i think honestly like one or two sprays this will last me a long time anyway so this is going to be my next order 100 percent amber infusion and i think it's possibly one of their um best buys so overall i'm like really happy with um my decision to get some dialect perfumes because yeah i was just so fed up of just not smelling nice <laughs> and i wanted to start smelling really good and you know when you just when you can smell yourself, you just feel a little bit better, don't you? So yeah, I have really been enjoying these fragrances. And I think out of the three of them, I have to say the Sweet Symphony is my favourite. It's so pretty. It's such a nice um, daily smell, I would say. Quite, quite sweet, but like a really pretty sweet. So yeah, I mean, if you see me around and you smell me around, <laughs> it's going to be Sweet Symphony. I will leave all their links for the each individual perfumes that I've got in the description below and I will also leave my discount code so you can yeah go and have a look at their website have a look I think they've got 26 on there to choose from they also do men's as well and they do like unisex ones which is the um, amber infusion is a unisex one go and have a look at their website I'm like so happy with it and I'm definitely going to reorder from there again so enjoy the discount code enjoy having a search and a research for all of their um, perfumes I think their website is so detailed but so simple you know what you're going to be buying yeah so if you're going to go perfume shopping go to dialect because I feel like that is going to be my new place to go now for um for scents for fragrances because not only are they nice and cheap they are also like high-end smelling like they smell incredible so you need to go and smell them yourself I wish you could smell my room right now I wish there was like smell a vision or something so you could just smell it all it smells gorgeous anyway thank you for watching this video and if you're still here watching it now then thank you um please like and subscribe and if you enjoyed this video then just leave a comment down below and maybe I will try and do a bit more um yeah hopefully I'll be able to get some more 
dialect fragrances and um, review some more for you. So yeah, if you enjoyed it, please do like and subscribe and I will see you in my next one. Thanks guys.